हेलो स्टूडेंट टुडे आई हैव ब्रॉड अ सिंपल ट्रिक टू काउंट सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर विदाउट मेमोराइजिंग द रूल एक्चुअली देर आर सो मेनी रूल्स आर गिवन अवर टेक्स्ट बुक एंड इट इज लिटिल डिफिकल्ट टू टू रिमेंबर ऑल दिस रूल सो हियर आई हैव ब्रॉड अ सिंपल ट्रिक टू काउंट सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर विदाउट मेमोराइजिंग द रूल ओके नाउ हियर यू हैव टू रिमेंबर ओनली वन और टू रूल्स फॉर दैट द फर्स्ट रूल इज फॉर द डेसिमल नंबर The rule for the decimal number is all digits are significant after first non-zero digit, and the rule for non-decimal number is significant figures start from first non-zero to last non-zero. You have to remember only these two rules. Now let's start example. Let's solve some example for this. Now here the number is given that is zero point zero one zero. So Zero point zero one two zero four. Okay. Now in this, in this number, the it is a decimal number, and the rule for decimal number is all digits are significant after first non-zero digit. So here the first non-zero digit is one. So after one, all digits are significant. So for that, here the significant number for this number is one, two, three, and four. So The significant figure for this number is four. Let's see another example. Now, look at here. The another example is two five zero zero, which is non-decimal number. And according to our rule, the no for non-decimal number, the significant figure start from first non-zero to last non-zero. So here the first non-zero digit is two, while last non-zero digit is five. So the significant figure are only two. So for this number, the significant figure is two. Now for this, the significant this is also a non-decimal number. The significant figure is one, two, three. For this number, the significant figure is three. Now here the another example that is zero point zero 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 three. Okay, for this number, it is a decimal number, and for the decimal number, all digits are significant after first non-zero digit. So here, first non-zero digit is three, but after that there is no digit is given. Therefore, the significant figure for this number is one. Now, the here the example is two zero six point four. This is a decimal number. As we know, the significant figure for this number will be the the first non uh, the uh, after first non-zero digit or significant uh, all numbers are significant. So here the significant figure for this number is one, two, three, and four. Okay. So here the significant figure for this number is four. Now let's take these two examples. These are very important, uh, interesting example. That is five zero zero point, and this is five zero zero. Okay. Now in this two digits. The first is a decimal number. This one is a decimal number. So according to decimal, our rule that for this the significant figure will be the. This is the first non-zero digit. After that, all are significant. Therefore, the significant figure for this number is three. While this number is a non-decimal number, and for non-decimal number, significant figure start from first non-zero to last. So here only one non-zero digit is there. Therefore, the significant figure for this number is. One. So the difference is because of this point, the significant figure for this number is three, while for this number is one. Now let's take another example. That is two, three point zero 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 zero. So significant. What is the significant figure for this number? It is a decimal number. So according to decimal number, the for after first non-zero all are significant for this. One, two, three, four, five, six. So significant figure for this number is six. Now here the another example is given that is six point five into ten raised to twenty three. Now here the exponential number is given. For this, when the exponential number is give, given, that time we should not consider this number in a significant figure to count significant figure. So here we will consider only this number six point five. So it is a decimal number. So significant figure for for this number will be the two. Okay. 
one more thing you have to remember for this to count significant figure while counting the significant figure if the counting number of object are given like for example two balls 20 eggs okay uh, like two balls 20 eggs so uh, uh, one dozen of banana okay so in such kind of figure or in such kind of number so we uh, the significant figure for this number will be the infinite okay infinite number okay so for two balls the significant figure is infinite for 12 dozen of banana the significant figure is infinite also for the fixed value like for example the value of pi the value of pi is 3.14 the significant figure for this number is also infinite okay for example another example if we talk about the Avogadro number what is the Avogadro number the value of Avogadro number is 6.022 into 10 raised to 23 for this also the significant figure will be the infinity for example speed of light what is the speed of light speed of light is the 3 into 10 raised to 8 10 raised to 8 meter per second for this also the significant figure a will be the infinity so these are the rules that you have to remember uh, to count the significant figure i hope you like this video if you like this video please do like and subscribe thank you so much